but what I'm after is these back buttons here. So for like Fortnite, for example, that can be amazing. So you can just be running about, you can press that to deploy builds. You can press that for jump. I used that a lot. So when I was jumping about shooting at someone with a shotgun, I could be pressing this button here to jump, circle, and then it doesn't mean I need to take my finger off the stick as well, which would be annoying if you would be going like jump, 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 and then you would get tagged. It'd be a nightmare. But what we really want to do is get these paddles assigned to buttons on the front here. So what you do is you hold down this button here and once you hold that down, this little LED under the X will start flashing. You can see that there and then you press the button you want. So I'm going to press A and then it'll flash quicker and then you select your paddle. So I'm going to pick the right one and boom, it will stop flashing and that means that has been selected. And for example, if I flick on over to the gameplay for you all right now. If I can just find the right button, do do do. There we go. And if we do that, I can just press the paddle now to start the game. Let's go to Newtown 24/7. Boom. So that is now assigned a very very cool. This is a great substitute as well um, for anyone who's wanting to get back paddles but does not want to spend a lot of money on a scuff controller or an elite controller if this works well this is a way to do it for 30 pounds very very cool 